started and we're also going to take a look at the Christmas market that she set up here at Piloto 151 at our Milla de Oro location. So Dacil, welcome. Thank you. I'm very happy to be here today. Thank you for having me. So Dacil, tell us about Real Curated Style. When did it start? What is it all about? Well, this began in 2009 um, and it started as Ruedo Vintage and recently we revamped what we had started then and did a whole rebranding into what we like to really do, which is curate. And so it's now curated style, which is the theme of this Christmas event as well. And that's what we're up to these days. Hey, I remember you had a store in Old San Juan, right? I did. Vintage. Yes, I did. And that it was, was a great the time. store that you started with, right? In 2009? Yes, that was the store we started with. And we were there uh, a few years. It was a really great part of the process and um, always a learning experience. So this time we're doing it a little bit differently. We have a showroom, uh, we're branching out to different areas, uh, styling, photo shoots, events, but everything within curated style, which is what defines us and makes us a little bit different, I think. Amazing, amazing. So tell us about what is happening today. Today we have done something different in that we are doing a Christmas kind of happening, but everything that you'll find here is either local, designers, we have a little bit of everything, clothing, jewelry, accessories, we have things for the home, and um, we have even delectables, little things to eat, uh, a beauty corner, so everything is one of a kind, nothing is like the, the one next to it. Uh, so it's creating an experience for shoppers that come and visit us and that's what Ruedo and um, everything that I, that I do uh, keeps in mind always. Amazing, so can we expect to see more of these events? I'm looking forward to doing more. This is only the first edition. We want to grow and um, continue reaching further in the market, bringing in fashion, art, music. Uh, Puerto Rico has a lot to give and so I'm really excited to kind of help uh, push that forward and show people what we can do and what we're up to. So tell us a little bit more about how curation works, right? The vintage market is a very established one. What does it mean to be vintage? First of all, I think some people don't know what it means to be vintage. And uh, how do you go through your process of selecting, curating, and how do you apply that to other areas? Well, in regards to the vintage uh, curated collections, um, I personally create my collections with current fashion trends in mind. So I choose the pieces that I sell based on what I forecast, what I see that's coming in the next seasons. Um, and I apply it, of course, to our market because we're in Puerto Rico. We don't have the same seasons as in the United States. Right. So um, I do it through patterns, through cuts that I'm seeing. And vintage, for those that really follow fashion, is actually the base of all fashion. It's not just it's taking not out just your old clothes. Season. No, okay. it's not just last season. It has to be 20 years plus in wow. order to be considered vintage. Wow, I did not know that. Yes. So, but yeah, I'm always looking. I'm always uh, looking for treasures and I love being able to tell the story of where that piece came from. And when I buy it directly from the person that sold it to me, I get to say that to the consumer who's now taking it into their own home and rocking it. And I source awesome. here, here in Puerto Rico. I also travel. Oh, you source here? Yeah. That's amazing. Yes, I try. Very I mean, cool. I love uh, trying to uh, shop locally. And uh, I also travel. Anytime I, I leave the island, I I'm always keep my eyes open for finding new things. Um, so I always come with goodies in my, in my suitcases. 
and uh, that curation process, I apply it to different parts of uh, my business. So if I'm styling somebody, I'm you know curating their look. Uh, if it's a professional and they have a specific type of a career where they need to look a certain way when they're in public, then we do a curation for their wardrobe for when they're out publicly. Um, and in this case for this event, the whole process has been in choosing specific vendors and styles that I think are within a same line train of thought, but are all very particularly different. So that's how I, how I do it. Can tell us a little bit more about your future plans and what we can expect to see from Drive Vintage. Wow, that's a good question. I have <laughs> big hopes. Um, I'm really open to, to growth uh, in the future. I hope that events like this one can turn into something that has more reach and we can expose what we're doing in our small little island to other countries, to the United States, to bring uh, people, artists, Puerto Ricans that um, are expats living in other places to come back and present what they're doing and how their life has been influenced by living outside of here but also coming, coming back to their roots. And so I'd love to apply it to other events, more editions of maybe not curated style Christmas but maybe curated, curated style summer, spring edition, uh, art edition, I don't know. We could, the sky's the limit. Wonderful. We're, we'll look, we're looking forward <laughs> to partnering with you. Thank you. To the events as well. For Piloto members, what can they expect in terms of the benefits of our partnership? Your members can expect to have a discount with us when they reach out. Um, it's a 10% discount on the services that they receive, and I'll be more than thrilled to hear from them. Uh, I'm always. I'm always available for Piloto and so grateful for this opportunity. Thank you, we're, we're grateful as well. How can local designers or people that are interested in styling some of your services or even going by your showroom get in touch with you? They can reach out through uh, our Facebook page is Ruedo Vintage. Um, our Instagram is at ruedo.curatedstyle and they can reach us always through our email, which is relevantage at gmail.com. And through Piloto, if, if they ever can't get a hold of me through those three lines, I'm always close by. Wonderful, you've just heard from Dacin Morales from Relo Curated Style, one of our Piloto Benefit partners. And thank you for tuning in to yet another Piloto Doer Story.